show really than a video. So that's where we began. Now, let me show you where we are now with Flash Player 10.1. Go full screen. doing this in partnership with uh, the device manufacturers. In this case, this is an HP Mini 311. It's got the Intel Atom processor in it. We've been working uh, with Intel and the NVIDIA Ion processor, uh, which is a great hardware accelerator for the graphics that you're seeing. And great work with NVIDIA. Now, the next one I want to show you here is another netbook that is a, another HP netbook. And this one is running the, it's a Mini 110, has the Intel Atom again, in this, this case the Broadcom Crystal HD acceleration. So we're working with Broadcom as well to deliver, again, really smooth video here running on this netbook. And then let's switch to the last one here. Uh, this is a netbook uh, that is driven by an ARM-based NVIDIA Tegra 2 processor uh, from Mobi Nova, and you can see the video also playing really well in that. So now you can get great flash experiences across netbooks as well with Flash Player 10.1. So now let's take a look. Great work by the teams on this thing. A lot, a lot of people cooperating to make that happen. Let's look at televisions. So I'm going to turn on my little TV here. You guys get to have the big TV. Um, and what we have here is our work on Flash Player on set-top boxes, uh, which will be coming into the market over time, and you'll be able to actually get an internet experience and streaming Flash video on your television set. And we're actually watching Flash video streaming in HD uh, on the TV here right now. I wish I had this TV in my house. Um, and this is a Broadcom set-top box. Now I can interact with this. You can see I can pop out a menu on the side. So this is a Flash user interface, and I can go and scroll around and look at different items. And if I want to, I can go and play some pre-recorded material. So here I'm going to the, the Nova uh, area of the device. And you can see I can interact and zoom between different sections. Notice the responsiveness is very quick on the set-top box. And I can go and play another piece of HD video content, uh, which is playing locally uh, in, in Flash HD format. In the extreme ice-bound regions of the Earth, something unprecedented... So again, incredible clarity with Flash video across not only networks, but also television sets. So thanks to the Flash team for really doing a great job on this. Okay. Progress with Flash Player. Now let's talk about Air. We have uh, Air 2.0 that we're working on right now. That, of course, includes uh, what we're working on in Flash Player 10.1, as well as updating webcam.